So this is a question I get a lot. How do you remove a seized engine from a car that has an automatic transmission and a torque converter? So I was able to get the seized engine out with the torque converter, but in a normal circumstance, if the engine was not seized, you would either have an area where you can come in and remove the bolts connecting the flywheel to the torque converter, or in my case, this is where the starter was sitting. So you'd remove the starter and have access to those bolts. But in my case, the engine was seized. So you can actually just pull the engine out with the torque converter right out of the transmission. You need a little bit more clearance. Now, thankfully in this BMW, you do have room in the front here. So you're gonna take the motor, push it forward and then crank up. It does make it a little bit more challenging and a little bit more frustrating, but it is doable.